There is rain in the area, but we've been given the go-ahead to get this one started. Today, a matchup of division rivals at opposite ends of the standings between the Toronto Blue Jays and the Boston Red Sox. These two should provide some big-time fireworks. First pitch is coming up. What's the play ball? Ow! Now at the plate, Jesse Winker that and the home away the splits tell us he's actually quite a bit better Jesse. hitting on the road than he is at home. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Number 78 is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. So a rather pedestrian start to the top half of the first. Toronto nothing. Sox coming to bat. You've got to tune to Major League Baseball, the show. Standing in, number 78. No one aboard for him, and two gone here in the first. First pitch coming, here it is. Takes this the other way to right. Luplo is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Sox go down one, two, three. Still no score. Start of the second here in Boston. Let's check in with Heidi for a bit more on the weather. Matt, I am hearing that heavier rain is expected to pass through the ballpark at some point later in the game. The umpiring crew would, of course, like to get this one in uninterrupted, but it is possible that we could be looking at some sort of a delay if they determine the weather is impacting the play on the field. At the plate, Cletus Mercaldi. He's 0 for the 1 thus out. far. Cletus Mercaldi. Hit the other way out toward right field. Two, two, Under two. it is the right fielder. Two down. Stepping into the box, number 78. And if you didn't number know, he was recently awarded the American League Player of the Month Award. First pitch of the at-bat. And this is lifted high in the air down the right field line. Into the stands, he got it! Stepping in, Cy Campanella. He'll try to follow up the double the in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Campanella. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Right fielder has a beat on it, and that's the first out of the inning. Ready for another chance. Now Ken that, Saunders. That, he got on top yeah. of one and was a ground out victim Saunders. last time. Line to the right side. And that's two, into two, the outfield two. for a one out base hit. Dan, how hard is it to massage your way through such a deep lineup? I mean, even the eight. Stepping in for the Jays, the Charles Sandoval. The Charles. Sandoval. Hit in the air out to right. Waiting on it, the right fielder. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. One left for Toronto, but they hold a 1 0 lead. Stepping up to the plate, number 78. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up.
There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Winker racing back. You can kiss it goodbye. So a solo shot here to left center field. Home run number 58 on the year. And the Red Sox have come back to knock things up at two. Yeah, he's been producing at the plate all year. So this should come as a surprise to nobody. But just because it's expected doesn't mean it's any less impressive. One swing and we are tied. Digging in to try it again. Now Number back. 78. Number He's got a chance to end this one and send these fans home happy if he can get a ball deep enough into the gap. Here's the first pitch. Runner goes for second. Here you go, make the turn, make the turn, make the turn. And that is just past his outstretched glove, and that ought to be a base hit. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double. No mistake what he was sitting on, looking for a dead red piece of cheese middle of the plate, and he didn't miss it. The first base now in the box, 23. Greg Lindsay. Greg. He's looking to bring home Lindsay. the winning run from third. He pulls this one into right. That ball's down, and he comes the winning run. And the winning run will score as they walk off with a 3-2 victory. Always great when a game really comes down to the ninth inning like it did here. They had a chance to walk it off and send their fans home happy, and that's exactly what they did. Lots of smiles around here right now. So we witnessed a close one here, but this man was a big factor in the outcome, so we're inclined to pencil him in as the top player of the game. Yeah, he came through with a multi-hit game, and more importantly, they were big hits. He was a key contributor to the outcome of this one. A one run game this afternoon, three to two, the final finish. The Boston Red Sox rack up a division leading 40th victory of the season. Brandon Woodruff wins in relief for the eighth time this year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For